Oh, there's growing outrage in Japan over so-called sushi terrorism pranks at conveyor belt restaurants. The latest involved three people who drank soy sauce directly from a communal bottle, amongst other things, sparking hygiene concerns. They have been arrested, but that's not the only case. Similar incidents filmed at different chains have also surfaced on Twitter and TikTok. CNA's Mitch Ishida tells us more. In Japan, there are many restaurant chains that allow customers to help themselves with seasoning, cups, utensils on or by each table. They are called kaiten sushi or conveyor belt sushi. The main reasons to cut costs and also because shop owners traditionally believed the Japanese are disciplined enough not to do anything unhygienic. But there have been cases of bad manners coming to light on social media, such as spitting on sushi and then returning them to conveyor belts for other customers to pick up and licking utensils and cups that the next customers may use. Those involved have come forward to apologize, but restaurants are seeking compensation. And will say minors who cannot be arrested should bear the cost too to pay huge compensation for damages. And if they cannot, then their parents will have to do so. That's because the reputation of conveyor belt sushi outlets have been damaged after such incidents. Even as they're now working hard to convince customers that dining with them is safe. Michio Ishida, CNA, Tokyo.